Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back. Thank you for joining me. My name is Melinda and welcome to the weekly vlog. Alright, it is Monday and what do you see behind me? And that's right, it is baseball. Guess what? We are in baseball season now. It's not karate on Monday. And that's the guys over there getting ready to start our first practice and then um, the next two weeks are going to be hectic. I only usually do one sport at a time, but because he is testing for his karate belt, we will be doing baseball on Mondays, karate on Wednesdays, until he tests next week, and then we will be in baseball for two months. All right, let's go baseball! Good morning, good morning, good morning. I am so tired. I worked until midnight last night, and um... It is the next morning, I'm bright and early. I have to get up, get ready, um, get the kids up, get them breakfast, and send one, well, send one. I have to drive over to school, and then the rest of the day I'll have the little one. I pick up the older one after chess this afternoon, and then it's go, go, go. He has a dentist appointment, we have karate, and then home. And you can tell the congestion is not going away. But it doesn't help with the long hours of work. Alright, I gotta go get ready for the day. Alright, I just got home. We went to Chuck E. Cheese. And do I order too much? Yeah. Look, Erin Condren. You're right, Mom. Um, thank you. You're right, it didn't come <gasps> out. Stitch Fix. Stitch Fix is right. I'm like, what is that? I don't know what that is. Facetory. And Mommy, stickers from Craft Penguin Planner. Let's bring them in. All right, so this is from Craft Penguin Planner, and look how cute she is. Skull um, washi tape. I'm like, what is it called? Washi tape. So cute. This is my order. Okay, this is freebies. So thank you, Jennifer. She's the owner of Craft Penguin Planner. Wow. You can hear my son this in the background. So these are freebies. Yeah. Oh, she gave me two. Oh, because I had to order twice because my bad. I'll show you why because I forgot. Oh my gosh, that's so nice of her. Love those little, sorry, candy corn headers. Hold on, buddy. This is a pack of freebies. Oh my gosh, there's some cute Halloween stuff in here. The theme was Halloween for this um, Where? PPC sale. Where's the play -Doh? And then this, um, because I purchased more than $25 worth, I got this for free, which is fantastic. These full boxes are so oh, cute. Can you send those again? And I'll have to make um, some of the half box and quarter boxes to go with it. Okay, this is my order. I ordered. Foil laundry washers and dry or dryers, depending on how you see it. I didn't have any laundry stickers, and so I was like, Oh, I need to get some. So I got them in the basic colors of rose gold, gold, yeah. silver. I love this rainbow, it's beautiful. I picked up some red because this is a new item in her shop. Red is my favorite color, and with the holidays coming, I have some red foil I thought would be great for some of those kits. So I got all the major ones I use in red. Okay, hold on one moment, please. And then I picked up laundry scripts. A couple of them. I picked up some grocery scripts, a couple. And but mochis. This is the one I had to reorder of, so I had to double order. But you know I love my bit mochis. Oh, success back there. So this is, um, I got two pages of the commute ones and two pages of need a ride for pickups. This is a, f oh, this comes with my order of Hocus Pocus Kid. Isn't it adorable? She does such a good job. The colors are amazing. So it comes with the full boxes, the half quarter, checklist and look at these checklists oh my gosh look they have cauldrons hats. good job buddy um the date covers 
washi. We're getting ready to do a project, so he's opening it. And um, headers and decor. And decor, super cute. So you will see this kit in my plan with me for one of the weeks of October. But there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I could actually do two weeks of this. Alrighty. And oh, let's look at my Erin Condren order. Alright, here is the Erin Condren order. Come in. <laughs> I hear you. Now hopefully it has everything in there. They have not been very good about quality control lately. Alright. All the packaging. So excited. Alright. So I picked up two of these. I see one. Hopefully there's another one in here. But I purchased two of these. This is their web wipes because I picked up their teacher calendar and laminated it so we can have a calendar in our kitchen for all the time. I will show it to you in a minute. I picked up this cover, which I told them that I wanted this combination. It's the ones you can put colors. And I picked up the white pumpkins for October. So cute. Like these. Okay, so the calendar, it comes with the date dots, which is nice for all the months because it is a unmarked calendar and it's laminated. I got it laminated. But you can get it not laminated for quite a bit less money. Okay, I need for you guys to get that done. Hold on. Yeah. All right. So it came with two sets of the day dots, which is nice. It just talks about the reversible calendar. It is a teacher calendar. I got the teacher one because I liked it. It had the bold colors. Um, I wasn't into the watercolor one. But one side is the month, as you can see. Tons of space. And the other side is a quote. My plan is to use... The month for our monthly calendar to go over so I am using this one the foiled calendar and we put it on the side of our refrigerator I do like that that is a layout that's um, horizontal and this one is vertical but I do like that it's laminated and so I can use their wet markers and I can use this every year. I don't have to keep buying a calendar. That's all the months and with quotes. And as you see, Hello. there was only one of these. So once again, I will have to contact Erin Condren. This happens every single time. They don't ever tell you if you're going to miss something or something was canceled because one year they canceled the production of my life planner and they didn't tell me and then not refund it. So, I mean, they did once I contacted them. I so, okay, buddy, we'll do the project in one second, okay? Um, the last order I did, they were missing the magnets and I had to reach out to them and they got those sent off right away. So now I'll have to reach out to them about these wipes and the only reason I got them is because they her wet pins are hard to get off and if I'm going to use them on this it will be nice to have the product to take it off all right so that's my Erin Condren order the rest of the things at the door were subscription boxes so you will see unboxings of those coming all right I'm gonna go do this craft for with my youngest one I'll show you Where's the box on what we're going to do? Oh, I need to pick that up. It's over here. Okay, right, I'm going to show them this is how it is. what we're going to do. He got this for his birthday from a dear friend of mine. And it's a clay dinosaurs. So it comes with these 
skeleton. Yeah, these skeletons. And you take the clays and you mold it over and however you want to make the dinosaur. Dino Dan. All right, so we're gonna do that Dino Dan. Don't do this one. Di Hello, everyone. It is Thursday. It's after work. I'm at the post office. I am dropping off my latest stitch fix, which you will see next week. I have it scheduled, or I will have it scheduled, to go up next week. It seems like I don't know how y'all feel about how. The weekly vlog is going but it seems so short to me now that I upload Thursday night to get ready for Friday morning I used to do a Monday through Friday weekly vlog but then you wouldn't see the weekly vlog until the following week and I do like the real time of this vlog but it doesn't seem like a lot, or maybe just this week, a lot didn't go on Monday through Thursday. Probably because I worked a lot this week. And it wasn't my Monday through Friday week, but I worked a super long shift on Thursday, which made me super, okay, how many times can I say super? Tired for Wednesday, and I had the little one home with me Wednesday and we were on the go a lot in the morning and then we picked up my older one who had a dentist appointment and then we had karate and then we came home and it's late and it's dinner and then bedtimes and blah 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 so here we are Thursday I'm still tired see falling asleep I'm still tired from that day and I'm still trying to get over this um, sickness, cold, congestion, whatever we want to call it. Doctor said it was a sinus infection, but it's still here. And we're on our third week now. I am starting to feel better, but it's just, I think being tired doesn't help. I don't know. So, I work today. I dropped off the stitch fix at the post office, so obviously I returned some items. And, well, I'm exchanging. I don't know. Spoiler alert. I exchanged. And then, um, for different sizes. And then, what are we doing? Oh! I'm like, what are we doing? I wanted to try to go to the park. It's super hot again today. I'm sorry, I keep rubbing myself. I'm so tired. My eyes. Sorry, I'm rubbing my eyes. That sounded weird. <coughs> but once again, it's hot. We're getting into the few weeks away from our cruise, which means I'm going to have to start picking up stuff after work that I need. I've started packing and started the pack with me that is going to go up before we leave, but there's still some items I need to pick up for the cruise that are on my list. And I like to do it as I go along so I don't have a huge list to pick up before packing, packing into the suitcase. So I'm going to start that probably, maybe I can start it tomorrow after work, but realistically it probably won't be until next week I'll start it when I'm a couple weeks out from the cruise. And then I think that's it. We have a very busy week coming up next week. We have started baseball, so baseball is now Monday nights. I need to do oh sorry we switch off and we don't do karate normally when we go to baseball but I think I said yesterday did I tell you yesterday I think I told you yesterday that we are in um kind of like a transition time because the belt test is coming up for karate and karate belt tests only come every like four months 
he's been ready like literally the week after their last bell test he got his stripe which means that he's ready stripe around his um belt meaning he's ready for the next test and um i just want to get through the test hopefully have him do well that he promotes to the next belt level and then um we will be on baseball season for two months for a fall ball fall ball is two and a half months but since we're doing half baseball half karate and then two months of straight baseball and then we'll go back to karate that's just one of the things that I have tried to implement to keep me sane is that we are only in one after school activity at a time and I say after school activity because um, the little one he's in daycare and they bring a lot of sports and extracurricular activity into that and I will sign him up for a lot so he's currently in gymnastics karate I think I signed him up for yoga and a music class because it's during their time the older one during well on their half day he has I signed him up for chess he really loves chess and um, we did it all last year I signed him up again this year but it's on campus and his after school program is also on campus so they just go and pick him up after chess and pick him up they walk walk over get him <coughs> excuse me <clears throat> so after working hours the only one that's in anything right now is my oldest which is karate and that's twice a week and I don't want every single night to be where I'm going to pick up somebody and then rushing off to whatever that activity is and then we rush home we rush and do homework we rush I want family life as well I'm not saying that that's not family life if that's you more power to you I do not have the energy to run around Monday through Sunday driving the boys around to activities so they each get one activity outside of their school. I just don't have it at me. Sorry. I cannot do it every day. Just me personally. If you can do it, great. Good job. I can't. Sorry. And um, so that's why we transition from karate to baseball. Baseball back to karate when he's out of the season for certain things. I hope this is making sense. Sorry, I'm so tired. And then the little one, I think in December, is going to start a dance class. They don't offer dance at his daycare. And he's asked me. Alright, so my video went out. And I didn't realize it until I got home and I was uploading. So sorry, it cut out. And it cut out where we were going to do dance for my little one. But that is it. And until next time, bye everyone.